So this is the Royal Mall, and this is where all the flying happens of the French, or well, most of it. And there's like there's like a stage with like live performance, and also another stage here. There's street performance here as well. Um, it's always very busy, as you can see, and it isn't even, even that busy. And today is the, my 12th show. Uh, I thought it would be interesting if I could try and show you a bit of how flyering goes and what I have to go through each day to try and get people to come see my fucking show. Take a flyer from me and come to my free comedy show. I can't hand them out because I'm trying to film, because I'm trying to become instant famous. Come to my free stand up comedy show. Free stand up comedy show in one hour. Free stand up comedy show. Free stand up comedy show starting in about one hour. I also tried to film this, so, so please, yeah, help me out. Um, make me and my viewers happy. Take a flyer and come to my comedy show. Free stand up comedy show. Oh, oh shit. Take a flyer from the pow. Help me out. Come see my comedy show. No, okay. Your disappointments will be filmed and put on YouTube. This vlog is brought to you by Red Bull. Right now it's about 10 o'clock and I'm on my way to his show again. Uh, another case of last moments dropouts. Uh, so I can do a 10 minute spot at a late night show. A uh, 5 minute spot, sorry, 5 minutes. But which, you know, normally I'll go like, eh, who gives a shit? But it's the fringe, it's only a half hour walk away from me. I have nothing else to do anyway. Plus, it's a good opportunity for me to hopefully make a good impression on some people from the UK comedy scene. Um, as for today's show, like my own show, it was a good one. I had 20 people in. Uh, <laughs> two people had because they got offended by my Hitler joke. Which, if people know that joke, who are watching, you know that it's not an offensive joke. Like, there's no reason to get offended at that. Um, and I love it, but oh well. The show itself it was good, people loved it, uh, even the people who eventually left because they got offended. Like I just really had, i say 90% of the crowd going for me the entire time, with some people just loving it a lot. Um, and yeah, some had some good improvisations. I don't think I made any big changes to jokes. But I did make the same changes again that I did previously, and they still work. So that means that proves they really do work. Um, so yeah, I've um, got eight more shows left. I'm still I'm feeling more energized again, also because the end is in sight. Um, tomorrow my parents will be visiting, so that's going to be fun. Uh, looking forward to that. I honestly do look forward to that. And uh, but for now I'm gonna try and rock these five minutes at Ciao Roma. Today has been a fun day because uh, yesterday my parents arrived in Edinburgh. So yeah, I showed them around yesterday at the festival and they really enjoyed it. And I was like, oh my god, this is so amazing! It's such a, like the energy and the business and everything. Like everywhere there's something to do or to see and today I took them up our first seat for quite a challenging hike but we survived and um, it was a nice hike great view uh, weather definitely was kind to us because we were afraid it was going to rain but it didn't rain and then my show good show really full really full room packed some people were standing Plus, I got to stop flyer early today because at like around five o'clock I already had a packed room and the show starts at quarter past five, so that was nice. And my parents saw the show, they liked the show, even the jokes that I made about them because um, my parents have a sense of humor. You know, who knew, right? No, no, my parents are great, so hey, today's been busy and fun. Uh, so now I'm gonna head back to the Airbnb relax and get ready for another day and tomorrow and the lo it's the last week so that's also nice it's countdown city so just seven more shows Whew. seven more shows 
So today my parents left back to the Netherlands after they've been here for the weekend, which was really fun. I managed to show them around Edinburgh, we did some touristy stuff, like I mentioned, I think, climbing uh, Arthur's Seat, which was fun. And yesterday we also went up to the castle and looked at that. Um, and so yeah, it, it's a shame that they're leaving already. They, they really enjoyed their stay here, which I'm happy with. And I enjoyed having them here, because you know, they're my parents and I like them. Um, and it was fun hanging out with some people, you know, especially people who aren't uh, also performers, because uh, it puts things in perspective. And it was a nice break for me in a way. And the shows of this weekend, like Saturday, uh, was great, like filled audience, filled room. Some people left, of course, because of the heat, but that wasn't alright because I, I had 39 people with like six standing, and like 10 people left in the end. So that was like fair enough. Because I also know now that I prefer it when people leave when they don't like it, and then I'm left with the people who do enjoy the show. And yesterday, yesterday was just wonderful. Uh, 25 people in, but they all loved it. A really good bucket uh, as well at the end, like a lot of the nations, um, which also makes me happy, of course. But like everybody enjoyed the show, and, like everything was on point. I improvised a lot. Like I, I, I think, well, I think it was like one of the first times I actually did the full 50 minutes, and that's with me forgetting two of my bits. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to, I'm hoping to carry over that energy today into my show. I've noticed the improvisation worked very well and the audience interaction worked very well and just talking with them uh, which I never done really before before I did the festival so I think that's like a major improvement point for me um, so I was really happy about it just on the adrenaline rush the entire time pretty much so excited for the show today just uh, six more to go and then we go home again which I'm also looking forward to, but first we're gonna knock out these six shows. Also, um, yeah, today some friends are coming over like for a week from the Netherlands, some comedians. So we're gonna hang out and watch comedy together and they're also coming to my show. So uh, that's gonna be good. Good times ahead, good times. All right, today I did another show, of course. And I got another packed room, um, like 32 seats covered. Uh, or 33 actually, 32, 33. I did a, the show itself was not my best. Um, but maybe I also have higher standards now because of some really amazing show. But basically, most of the people in the audience were really on board with what I did and loved it. Uh, and some people didn't like it. It was really not their thing. I think like two women in the audience were this 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 close to sleeping. Um, also, the heat in the room today was quite bad because it was also hot outside and full room, so it gets really hot in our venue. Uh, so that doesn't help, of course. Um, the general good show. Uh, I'm, I'm definitely noticed. That I'm improving throughout the festival, also because I'm raising more money uh, by donations at the end of the show, and I have fuller rooms because I'm better at flyering, which in a way is a, in itself is a form of performing, at least in my opinion. And then I spent some time again with the great comedians Ruth, Kashun, and Steven. I uh, went to see some shows together, just having fun as well making horrible puns all the time and other crazy jokes and um, the, end is in, the end is near uh, so yeah, just four more shows left and uh, in a way I'm looking forward to it in another way I'm sad it's ending because I've been improving so much and if I can like I feel like if I could do this if I would have done this well from the start which obviously is doom thinking but still so far that creeps into my head. Um, I could have done way better. I could have done made way more money. Uh, I, I could have lost less money maybe. Um, so yeah, that's a shame. But I'll just take it into account for next year. Um, and now 
I'm off to bed because I'm tired. Just four more shows.